Hello, my lovely Gemini. How are you, loves? I hope everybody is well. Gemini, welcome to your weekend reading, weekend energies, Sun, Moon, Rising Science, and Venus Science. Happy birthday, loves. We are in your season. We just actually moved, and as well, we are approaching the full moon and the lunar eclipse which are both in Sagittarius, the opposite zodiac sign of yours. But I've been called by Spirit today to make a weekend reading as the energies are quite high. Let's see here what we have for you and where we go with your energy. A very... So many zodiac signs, honestly, to you, Gemini, got so strong messages let's hear how yours are an overarching energy seven of pentacles king of swords and two of swords voila ace of wands refusing to wait anymore it's like i'm not waiting anymore i'm done with this next there is very very energy like you know i i'm not gonna do this anymore i'm not gonna wait i'm not gonna put effort i'm not done two of swords is like you refuse something you have to do and now it's just like you know i'm gonna do it this new thing for some of you that could be you in regards to the situation you are in or in regards with a person you are in let's see knight of pentacles Two of Cups, Star, Ten of Cups, Three of Swords, High Priestess. You just know also this action is happening in a very, very short time. Could be within this weekend or in the next three days. Temperance, Queen of Pentacles, and King of Pentacles. All right, loves. What I feel here, you still love somebody and that person also still loves you. The thing is, there is needs a lot of healing in this energy. Also, you might deal here with another air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, or somebody who have air in the chart and also could be a Taurus Virgo Capricorn we have Pisces and Sagittarius as well so there is something here for some of you could be a third party you are dealing and the thing is this person is not just you know have passion for you but they do love you but the thing is, you could wait for a very long time for this person and basically hurts. And for others of you, this could be you and your person. There is certain things here which indeed needs to be healed between you two. Because as you see here, many times I will read this way, many times diagonally, and many times this or this. You know, there are many, many ways. But the thing is, what I'm seeing here, the hurt is right here. We'll clarify this three of swords here. But diagonally here very much speaks that the heart needs to be healed. And I feel here... It's like whatever it is, communication is missing. It's not like we love each other because you do. But somebody here feels like, you know, I'm not going to stay just like that. Let's clarify really quick this Three of Swords. What's this Three of Swords here for? Six of Swords. Chariot. Yeah, this is happening in a very short time. Whatever action needs to death. This is going to end here. 
It's like the silence treatment doesn't work anymore. For some of you, indeed, here, there is a connection here which goes very slow. For others of you, there is a third party you're waiting for a very long time. And for others, there is a, a person you are dealing and you basically are back to back. Doesn't go. Whatsoever, I feel here that things are changing. And they are big time changing. And I feel here you do make these moves, Gemini. You are making them. If you took your time or you trying to, to make certain things here to work, now you just feel like, you know, I just need something else. Two of Swords is like, you know, I, it's like there's something here you, you refuse to do. It's like not anymore. And I feel here, once you decide here, not anymore, either the tra uh, the silent treatment or waiting for communication, is like when you decide to not wait anymore, there is coming communication. There is a message coming in. It's like when I decided to move on, ba-bam, start to communicating. And also, it's like your intuition told you that. Once you do this move, you will see certain results. And you do. Let's see here. High Priestess, what are you feeling here? There he is. Four of Pentacles. You see, you've been holding on for too long for something. And now, not anymore. King of Wands. Yeah. You take actions. You take actions. On other hand here, there's another person here My wait for you, loves. And you might block them just because you've been waiting for that person or are you waiting an answer from that person. One more card here, Spirit. Thank you. Four of Wands. Here he is. And Four of Swords underneath here. So, loves, whatever situation you've been and you've been holding on on that. I feel here, once you let it go, a lot of things are start opening up for you if you really want to have a reconciliation with somebody once you just let it go it's like kind of like you know i don't care i'm moving on whatever it is it is and things like that and that person is coming for others of you if you waited here for somebody to come forward to talk to you once you release or you feel like you're releasing them they're coming and for some of you, if you try to work things with somebody and indeed doesn't go, once you release that, actually comes the person who will actually look and work with you on a relationship. So be very careful to not hold back and as, as well to not close your heart. Just because whatever you've been hurt here or whoever hurt you. Okay? You might need to take your time. I feel here it's more like um, a couple here which they don't really get along anymore. And there is very much silence. Whatever hurt been, whatever things somebody here needed to change, somebody here, you know, waiting for that person to come up. It's like, like it's coming like midlife crisis for some of you. And somebody here really wanted deeply something else. 
and other like just didn't feel like there's something here like things have been quite slow and it's kind of like the, the communication we're not and things like that but now is the movement now it's like you know now I'm going now I'm going and I feel here whoever I've been like you know I'm not gonna block myself I'm not gonna do this it's okay if we'll come we'll come and just once is just like you know with this six of swords like if i said this i'm moving and babam comes so let's see here two of swords what is here for for you gemini two of swords empress knight of wands and seven of swords and underneath we do have the magician you know it's coming here whoever it's coming here but as you see here we have the empress and the knight of wands the empress is a mother the knight of wands is a single person so basically, two of swords here is like, I'm not gonna let myself in. Five of swords, because I want the cake and eat it too. Think otherwise, loves, because five of swords does not quite good. I feel here you, you're looking for opportunities here, or for, for things here to do. It's like what was best for me, was the best situation for me. So I don't see you completely single. Even the things could be, you know, quite shaky. I feel here this are changing. And indeed here there is coming somebody here for stability. You might sense it, you might not. But don't hold back. Do not hold back. For some of you, you are here, Gemini, since you were a teenager and now, you know, growing, it's more likely you grow apart with this person. And over the sudden, one of you feels like we don't have nothing in common. It's like our, our wishes, our aspirations are very different. And somebody from this two doesn't get it. What do you mean through this? But indeed here, there's a Gemini here who feel like, you know, I waited for so long for this person to do this and they not. Let's see here. One advice for you, Gemini. Fool, take a leap of faith. And underneath we have Seven of Swords. But whatever you do here, don't do it just because that benefits you. Hierophant. This could be the one who you've been married or now could be separated from. Or you will, or you are thinking to. Because I feel here you are thinking of a new journey. And you will embrace a new journey. But also somebody here will feel like whatever you do or whatever you want to to do is not good, is not fair.
for others of you, you stayed in a connection which were were ended long ago. But you stayed because you you thought maybe this will change. But now it's just like no. This is not gonna do, and I gotta do something about it. And it's kind of you. It seems like you found the solution. Taking a leap of faith, moving forward with your life, changing certain things here. For some of you, is an actual move actually here. For some of you, you could move your home. For some of you, you could move the residence or even the location where you're living. And I feel here you you sense whoever comes to you will be very, very strongly looking like you. Will have pretty the same aspirations. It's quite like sometimes you might be in, intimidated by them, but not in a bad way, but it's like, It's kind of like they they are thinking like me, they are quite crazy like me, they have, you know, those vibration like me. It's not like that that you, hey, I'm intimidated because they are stronger or anything. Like they they feel like quite like you. And that is kind of like if you before could anticipate certain things like now you feel like like you cannot predict whatever they are going to do next and things like that. But I feel here it's a good challenge for you, for you. This could even transform your life. Whoever is this person coming towards you here. So, Gemini, good, good energy. Love and light. And if that's feel resonating with you and connects with you let me know down below your feedback is very much appreciated and of course if you are always here and you want to be part of this beautiful family do not forget to subscribe like and share share with whoever you feel they might benefit from this energy many blessings and have an awesome weekend gemini namaste